Reigning Junior WRC champion Pyrie claimed a jaw-dropping six Wolf stage win points on the opening full day of action on Rally de Portugal. The Finns' day got off to a troublesome start with a puncture on the opening stage of Friday, a sign of the drama and attrition ahead for Junior WRC. William Crichton found himself in contention for another podium spot at the end of Friday morning's loop of stages, but after the second pass of the Goyish stage, Crichton had damaged too many tyres, running out of spares, bringing his day to a premature end. Park at the end of the road here, unfortunately. You don't? Yeah, that's a stop for the but Yeah, uh, I tried to be as neat as I could, driving slow, and yeah, I thought, we were, I, thought I was doing a good job. But. John Armstrong got off to a great start on Friday, taking an early lead that stretched out to over a minute by the end of stage six, after claiming a stage win on the opening stage of the day. A treacherous second pass of the Argonnell stage lay ahead, which saw the Northern Irishman's fortunes change, suffering mechanical damage, forcing an early retirement for the day. Next on the list of Junior WRC's casualties was Kenya's McRae Kimathi, who was running as high as third in Junior WRC during the eighth stage of the rally, until he had an accident stopping any hopes of a dream podium finish. Despite taking a stage win on the second stage of the day, Robert Verves had a troublesome morning loop. Through perseverance and some impressive times, the Estonian kept his head in the game, ending the day with a respectable third following an exhausting day of hard rallying. Sitting second overnight in Junior WRC is Larry Yuna, who drove a trouble-free day to deliver a solid second place and is keeping the pressure on Pyrie with over half of the rally still left to run. Well, I just take into uh, carefully, uh, just uh, avoid any mistakes and uh, punctures. So I think they uh, try to push, but sometimes it can pay off and sometimes not. Despite having some trouble early on in the day, Pyrie kept his nose clean, which saw him end the day with an impressive three-minute lead of a fellow countryman, Yuna. Well, for sure, it it has been really, really rough, and uh, yeah, but it's still two more days to go, so we, we, we are just, we are not even halfway, I think. Looking at the standings at the end of the second day of Rally de Portugal, Sammy Pyre leads Larry Yuna by 3 minutes and 38.5 seconds, Robert Verves third, John Armstrong fourth, and McRae Kamathi fifth. And at the Wolf stage win points, Sammy Pyre tops the table with six, Robert Verves second with two, and John Armstrong third with a solitary one stage win.